Nicholas Adine, right? Correct. <laughs> Robbie Doherty here with CurlingZone.com. I'm here with Nicholas Adin, Skip of Team Sweden, or as they've been appropriately dubbed, the Swedish House Mafia, because they were just killing it out there. Nicholas, it's a good way to turn the week around. How do you feel after that? Yeah, we needed a win badly in that game, and uh, we got a good start and then just uh, kept rolling from there. We got a couple of easy mistakes from them too, so uh, felt really good to get some rest now, and then uh, two tough games tomorrow as well. Now, as a team, is this your first time in Canada? Almost. I've uh, been there a couple of times before. A couple of times. Well, speaking of that, I know that uh, European teams like to come over here to play to get the competition and such, but usually that takes place in Western Canada. Tell me, what's the East Coast hospitality been like? It's been superb, uh, except for the snow. I uh, shouldn't have had that here, but uh, it's been really nice. Uh, lots of good food, restaurants, people are nice. It's, it's awesome so far. Speaking of food, um, have you guys been going out to eat a lot, or did you bring the Swedish chef with you? Both. Uh, did a bit of both, actually. We, we uh, uh, make our own breakfast because it was so expensive at the hotel and we got a low budget, but uh, been eating good lunch and dinners out and uh, it's been good. And between ends, do you snack on anything with protein or did you just stick with the old Swedish berries? <laughs> uh, more of the protein stuff, but uh, we get a couple of bananas too, so if the counts as a berry, uh, that's fine too. Very good. Uh, you, you brought a cheering section with you. One question that I have is... Why do, does it come out sometimes naturally so angry sounding instead of, yay Sweden, it's better Sweden. Uh, it comes from the Vikings, I guess. We, we need to be angry like uh, to stay alive as a kid and then it just follows you. Sending a message. What's the plan for the rest of the week? Uh, hopefully keep winning. Uh, we're going to try to make some shots out there and uh, put pressure on our opponents. And uh, if we can figure out the ice and the rocks just a touch more, uh, I think we're going to make a few shots. Definitely a fan favorite here in Halifax. Good luck, Nicholas. All the best. Thanks for checking this video out. For more great videos from the 2015 Ford World Men's Curling Championships, check out curlingzone.com. I'm Robbie Doherty.